Hey, I'm Rafael Rossell, a Cosmo Center for Hall of Famer, and you're watching Cosmo TV. When I got here in early 2001, Hindi ako ganun kasanay na nag work out. Basically, if you're not from showbiz, I realized na you just take your body for as it is. But once you become conscious of the modeling world, that's when you start realizing, ah, you do need a six-pack. Ah, you do need like cuts in your shoulders and cuts this and cuts that. So basically, it changed my life in a way that I started going to the gym a lot. Sexy about me. Well, it would be different if you asked me this question last year and the year before that. But now, I think it's my calmness in life. Two years ago, I decided that I don't want to stress out about things I'm not in control over anymore. So, hindi na ako nagsis stress. Kahit traffic, kahit malilate, or may dahilan lahat eh. So, para sa akin, maybe it could be viewed as sexy that I'm just really chill all the time. I don't like negativity, I don't like negative vibrations. It's all about the positive vibrations. It's about having fun and just enjoying life. I used to read Cosmo, and uh, every time I see a hot cover or a pretty, beautiful cover, I always check out the article, but uh, I think the inside stories are more targeted for girls, so uh, I leave the reading to the girls. <laughs> I've noticed, and I, I really think it's because of Cosmo, that women have become more um, independent, stronger, uh, they don't need men, you know, whatever. Hindi na kailangan yun, they've become better with their makeup. Women look better than ever now, and yeah, women rock, and I think Cosmo has a lot of, you know, has a lot of say to that. Um, para sa akin, if a girl walks in and she's super pretty and she doesn't have confidence, wala eh. If a girlfriend or a potential girlfriend is super sexy and super hot and pretty and everything is there, but she needs constant reassurance and she needs to reassess herself all the time, that kind of takes away the sexiness. I think sexiness is confidence in just being in the now. What women should understand with men, I think you just have to understand that we do have this thing called our cave. And uh, whatever goes on in that cave or personal space or whatever, intindihin nyo na lang. Just like we have to understand that once in a month type of thing that you guys have. I've been single for a year and a half due to personal choice and also I guess I haven't found the right one yet. And I have to say, I'm discovering a lot of things about myself, a lot about uh, things about other people and uh, learning a lot about the world. So uh, until I meet the right one or the one who can sweep me off my feet or whatever, <laughs> um, I'm, I intend to stay with it. Right now, I don't have a particular type, but usually I do fall for the chinita mix. Um, my type basically is just someone who's comfortable with themselves. Just be yourself. I can't emphasize that enough. And I bet a lot of other people you've interviewed have said that. Just be yourself simply because it's the best. Just be yourself. Why be someone you're not? So it's very cliche, and uh, I am going to repeat it. Just be yourself.